Following total atomic annihilation, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. That's why we at Vault-Tec have prepared these educational materials for you to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. Got your rabbit's foot? Good. It's time we talk about luck. The difference between whether you live or die in the post-nuclear world may depend on the flip of a coin. Luck is a mysterious sort of curiosity. See here? A well-placed shot may not always do the trick. If Lady Luck favors you, though, you'll find those critical moments a breeze. What's this? Only scrounging up duds? Time and patience may net you a suitable collection, but with luck on your side, you're bound to find some swell keepers. No, no, hold on to anything shiny. It may be of hidden value. Be careful not to get distracted by your newfound fortunes. Uh-oh, that wasn't the only pest. It looks like luck has helped you once again. Unfortunately, she can't save you from every situation. At least your misfortune can become someone else's fortune. Luck may be fickle, but if you can woo her to your side, the possibilities are endless. A particularly bloody mess with little a chance to build a streak of destruction that cut the magic of the unexpected all. Regularly study your vault tech provided materials to prepare for survival. And to answer the question, do you know what makes you special? What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Sinistrina1, and welcome to my walkthrough for Fallout 4. That is right. I'm a huge fan of the Fallout series. I think a lot of you out there are. And I would love to know in the comments below, what is your favorite Fallout game? Is it by Bethesda? Is it the early Fallout games? Maybe it's Obsidian's Fallout New Vegas. Please let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Twitch, as I will be live streaming this game a lot in the future. I want to make sure to get out as many videos to you guys as possible as this is the kind of game that uh, the story is just so involved and there's just so much to it and I can't wait to actually show you guys some of this gameplay and we can get into this. So this is on the PC version. Everything is set to max. I'm actually playing this in 4K but I'm showing you in 1080. Uh, the settings you can choose outside of the game you don't actually see them inside. So we're just gonna get right into this. I'm so excited to be able to show this guys to you. If you've never been to my channel, you know, take a look around. Hopefully you'll like something. Uh, I'm known as the stealth gamer, but at the same time, I love to play all kinds of video games. I try to be more thorough. I try to, you know, talk about games in a manner of to appreciate the time and effort the developers go into actually making these games. And I try to show that for all of you out there as well. So again, guys, thank you so much for all the love and support that you already give me. And uh, together, this community can grow more and more. Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you Fallout 4. It's go time. My great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife 
and the sun he'd never seen. He got his wish. When the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, It's that war, war never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the veterans hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. All right, ladies and gents, here we go. Take a look at all the presets here. All right, looks like we got 15. I think I already saw the one I want. Yeah, we're going to go with number seven. Now, I'm not going to get too much into this. Uh, there's, it's very extensive as far as everything that you guys can do. I do want to show you guys a little bit. Lots of customizable options here. <laughs> Beatnik. I think I'm going to go with... Uh, let's see... I'm gonna go with a rebel. Did you put a little color in your hair? We're gonna give ourselves a little bit of graying because I feel like he's he's more of a veteran. So we'll give himself a little bit of grain, but not too much. Hmm, this new haircut's really working for me. Now you can sculpt. Everything is done by using the uh, directional pad as well as the left thumbstick. So many different options that you could do. You could do the scale, bring things in. You have such a strong chin. I'm gonna go with a little bit of a tanned look here. You can also what do you change think, huh? the type. Roguishly handsome or handsomely roguish. I like that look. You look as good as the day we met. I'm looking good, if I do say so myself. Can change so much with the eye. I mean, it's the the detail is just so amazing, what you can do. Your eyes. That's the reason I said yes when you asked me out.
We're gonna go with a blue. Yeah, not bad. You can actually change your wife as well. If you want to play as a female, you know, that's something you can do. So I'll show a few options for her. You can go with that face or you can switch it up. You know, if you like Harley Quinn, perfect look right there. You get a haircut yesterday? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that works. Such a cute nose. I still got it. Are you staring at those lips too? Or is that just me? like that <laughs> it's so great there's just so much you could do with this absolutely lovely All right, so I think that looks good. Not bad. All right, as you can see, you can also change the body. You can go for a more muscular, thin type of look. Let me just slide in here. One thing I would like to see would be his nose come down just a little bit. Hun, do you think my nose is too big? We'll sculpt it down. Let's see. You can bring it out. You bring it in. <laughs> Give him a giraffe kind of a look. Such a cute nose. All right, I think I'm happy with this. I think we're ready to do this. Also, uh, just to show you guys, there's also markings that you can do, freckles. There's blemishes you can put all over your face. I mean, the, the list is just truly amazing how many different things that you can do. And uh, whenever you guys end up getting this, you're going to be able to spend hours and hours just on this alone. You know, give yourself a big boss scar if you want to. He looks like he already has a scar on his eye too, maybe from the war. So, with that being said, guys, hopefully you guys enjoy, and here we go. Hey, hon. Hmm, just getting ready. A 
Abraxo for all your cleaning needs. Another fine product of General Atomics International. We really need to get those vacation photos developed. No need to get dressed twice. And you can also go third person if you want. Huh. How'd you get on the floor, Mr. Bear? Can't wait to teach him to ride this. <laughs> He'll either be great at spelling or great at smashing blocks together. <laughs> the glove's a little big right now, but Sean will grow into it. Should get this signed next time we're at the park. Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Sugar bombs. 100% daily value of sugar. Hmm. More of the same. Now, who left those here? You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. But then we're looking at a cold front coming down from Canada, making it crisp and dry for next week's Halloween festivities. Looking in on next week's forecast, we have a high of 52 on Monday. We also fear our troops stationed overseas are experiencing some unusual weather as well. On the island of Mamba, good old USA. Huh? Nervous? Don't be. Everyone's gonna love this speech. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes from. Good morning! Vault Tech calling. Vault Tech? Remind me again? Why, we're about you, sir, and helping secure your future. You see, Voltec is the foremost builder of state-of-the-art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. I love how they got Colonel Roy Campbell to play this guy. Because it's I, I, I've grown up with so many good voice actors in video games, and I, I'm actually someone that pays attention to this. And you can easily tell that that is Paul Eiding doing the voice, and I, I love that. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid. And coming sooner than you may think, if you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. I'm a little busy right now. Oh, of course, of course. This won't take but a moment. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Need to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of, uh, <coughs> total atomic annihilation. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. 
Now I can't wait for the world to end. Ha <laughs> ha! That's the spirit. Now, let's see. All right, here we go. It's time to upgrade our, or excuse me, our registration form. So we're already set to one. So if we set the, let's get a middle of the road going on here. And then we can kind of go from there. Um, strength, I'm going to one up. I, I know I'm going to want that to be something. Uh, to fix your total health and the action points. Drain from sprinting. Take that down and we'll go five. Yeah, I think that's good. Nice middle, nice middle of the road. We'll go ahead and set our name here. And we're ready to go. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> you heard Codsworth. Go on. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Fun. What's wrong with Codsworth? Followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my god. We we need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Um, hey there. What's going on? Why is everyone yelling? Okay. Vault participants, head this way! Never leave your wife behind. Hold on to Sean. The vault's Check this in way. At the gate. Come on. That's absurd. I am Not on the vault. Check. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop me. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. I'm reporting this. If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home. We need to get in. We're on the list. Yeah, we're gonna die. Infant. Adult male. Adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, man. You two, follow me. God, Come on. Sorry. What's gonna happen to all those people outside we're doing the gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh, oh my god! No, no! Down Hold on! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh 
Hun? Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... No, no, we don't. Don't be. get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. All new residents, just this way, please, please proceed in an orderly fashion. This way. Welcome no. home. This way, please. Mail. Just this way. This one's good. Mail. Step oh, over to the table mail. and take a suit. Okay. Female. Levels are good. Hey, just step over to the good. table. Welcome. Pick up Here a suit right over there. Head down yeah, the hall looks there. Fine. Right over there. You'll please. need your suits before we can take you further. Uh, thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we have. My mother and father down in D.C. How, oh God, honey. how long do you think it? we'll be down here? I know this is a difficult oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical day. items we have to get checking everyone off the list as they come in. to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Just, excuse me, just step into the chamber. Shh. It'll be okay. Daddy's right here. See? Who's my little guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set? Just step inside and put on your vault suit. Hey, hon. Go ahead. I just want to give Sean a moment. I love you, baby. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. <sighs> Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, two, one.
Come on! There has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Wow. What a way to just get you sucked right into the story. Alright, ladies and gents, here we go. Why would Voltaire do this? Ah, it's just like alien isolation. I love this. Oh yeah, we got the VAT system. I can't wait to really use it. I was gonna try to go for Giant a stealth kill. Roaches? What the hell? Probably not gonna work though. Red Menace. <laughs> oh, that's just like Donkey Kong. Nice. Oh, we got all the way to the top. Oh, that's great. All right.
Oh. Oh, we just missed it. Alright, we got one more life. Come on, we can do this. Oh. Wait till it gets back up. Nice. Do we have to get all of these? Is that what it is? Nice. <laughs> Alright, we've seen enough, guys. That's pretty cool, though. Alright, eject hollow tape. Sweet, so we can actually take it with us. Oh, I didn't get in the top ten. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Wonder what other kind of cool games they're going to have in this. Little mini games, I guess. Gotta keep moving. You sly devil, you. Look like... I didn't see where you came from. I knew there was one there, but I didn't see where it came from. Alright, we got... Ooh. Kind of like our melee power, I guess, right there. Nice. What happened here? Where is everyone? Nice. Coming back later for you. Terminal's gotta be somewhere. We did get a bobby pin. Won't be able to pick this. All right. So the bobby pin, I guess, are the lock picks. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna be using that system a lot.
I really love the way that the uh, the weapons feel. Woo! Let's go ahead and use one of those stim packs. See how that works. Thirty percent of your health is automatically given back to you. Is this all that's left? Alright, I see where we are. Is anyone alive? This is the door we couldn't get through Can earlier. Anyone get out? Yeah. Like I said, I'll try to do my best to pick up as much Looting stuff around that you're gonna need, because obviously this game is all about looting and stuff. Oh, uh, here we go. Alright, so we've got stat, inventory, data, map, radio, and then each of them have sub-levels, status, special, perks. Let's look at our perk chart. That is a lot of perks. Oh, I can't wait to get into this. Alright, so before we really even get into all of this, you know, there's just so much that we're going to be getting into a little bit later. Quest right now is out of time. Vault door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. Alright ladies and gents, it is time to go out into the open world, and what a perfect time to do a little quick save. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Let me know how excited you are to see some more Fallout 4 content, as I am very excited to get into this world and to show you guys everything about it. Of course, I will see you next time. Peace out. Bitches! Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech.